Ladies and gentlemen, we got him. Hi guys and welcome to another Fool of the Week. And this week's Fool may not actually be a Fool, but could be quite crafty. Labour MP Chris Bryant retweeted an image of an empty supermarket shelf that contained filler. The filler text had been photoshopped out and replaced with anti-Brexit and anti-Brexiteer slogans. Chris then deleted his original retweet and apologised. Well, let's have a look at the image uh, itself. So you can see here Chris Brand's tweet. It says, my profound apologies. I hadn't noticed the appalling language and I've removed the retweet. Again, I apologise. So what does the, Im this was originally posted by Talk Radio, which is pro-Tory, pro-Brexit. And you can see here, please bear with us. We're having something, uh, got anything left. Brexit caused this. Uh, all other COVID affected countries have plenty of stock. You thick twats probably voted conservative too, huh? <laughs> if you voted for Brexit, you can F off probably out of here. Um, and finally, if you did not vote for this, then we are truly sorry. <laughs> so Brexiteers are not very happy. Talk radio is not very happy. They posted this, of course, wanting a reaction. Uh, and Chris retweeted it to get a few laughs, obviously, then realized mm, probably the language was not something uh, honorable for a politician to retweet. So he deleted his tweet. So Chris is our fool of the week or was Chris being extremely crafty? Let me know in the comments section, guys, what you think. And I'll see you next week for our next fool of the week. I want to say a big, big thank you to all of my patrons. You ensure that this channel continues to exist. I'm eternally grateful for all of your support. If you join Patreon, you will receive instant access to our Discord server, where we have both audio and video chats. You can chat with me and other patrons, where we discuss important and non-important issues. Becoming a patron per month costs about the same as a large coffee. So why not check it out?